I've said it in the past, and I can say it again, all things, including religion, must evolve with time. If some practices are outdated, they must end. And our next story is about one such practice that has no place in today's world, yet it continues to be enforced in the name of God. Let me show you this video. It's from Nigeria. It's very disturbing. It shows a young girl being lashed by four men. This video is not from a court or a police station. This, what you see here, is happening in a school in Nigeria's Kawara state. The girl you see is a student and she's been accused of drinking alcohol. So what does the school do? It gathers all its students and flogs the girl in Taliban style to set an example. It is unsettling to watch. I'll tell you what's worse. This punishment was carried out with the approval of the girl's parents. Apparently, the girl's father saw her drinking and he instructed the school to punish her. He has been quoted as saying this. Let me read it out for you. I informed the school about the incident and I personally requested them to give her the appropriate punishment and I insisted I should be present when they carried it out. What kind of parent does such a thing? If, if a child does something wrong, there are a thousand other ways to make them fix it. Getting them whipped in school is barbaric. And how does any school allow such a thing? It says it was only complying with the Islamic law. That's the school's defense, complying with the Islamic law, the same law that varies from country to country and is adjusted to suit those in power. It's outrageous how religion always becomes an excuse for brutality. Thankfully, the people of Nigeria do not agree with this punishment. They are condemning the school. They're calling for the arrest of the teachers and parents. What about the political leaders of Nigeria? The public anger has forced them to act. The Kawara state government has suspended the school's principal. It is investigating the actions of the parents. It has also set up a committee to deal with such cases. Now here's the thing, flogging may or may not be permitted in Islam. It may or may not be justified in the Quran. I don't even want to get into that debate right now. All I want to say is this, this is 2021. There is no place for such medieval practices in this day and age. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.